We're breaking here this midday, Arlington police announced two major developments in murder investigations, and they've made arrests in both cases. NBC 5's The Head of Rahman joins us live now with what police know about the murders and what they're still trying to figure out. The Hedda? Yeah, Evan, well, let's break this down case by case. The first murder that we're talking about today happened back in December, and that victim was a 56-year-old woman named Tho Tu. Police say this man, Fernando Taylor, came up from Houston and targeted a 56-year-old woman here in Arlington, following her for about an hour. When she got out of her car to go to work, police say Taylor grabbed her purse. In that struggle, police say the victim fell and police say Taylor ran over her as he left the scene. Arlington police say they worked with Houston PD to find and arrest Taylor. The second murder happened about two weeks later. A group of people beat 51-year-old Frank Kwasnicka to death. Police have arrested these three men in connection with that case with the help of the U.S. Marshals. They say a witness's cell phone video showed two suspects hitting Kwasnicka repeatedly with a large object. I can tell you uh, the victim's injuries were so, so severe that it took us almost two days to positively identify who he was. Now, in that second murder case, police believe that that beating happened after a crash. But in both cases, they are still trying to nail down a motive behind these crimes. In Arlington, Fahir Rahman, NBC5. Fahir, thank you.